think she's in here. Fancy. Fancy. <gasps> Baby. You want to come home? Hi, Foozers. Hi. Hi, Foozers. Hi. I missed you. I missed you. Did you have fun? Did you have fun? Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Yeah, I missed you. I missed you. I missed you. I know. I missed you. You come home? Yeah? You come home? Yeah? Go, it's time to go home? Okay. So, uh -uh. so when she puts her head up to look around, I say, no, 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 you need to pay attention to me. And how do you communicate that? So it's mainly I just, I push my inside leg on, and I just make it look sideways. And then I flex, and when you flex them, it's like, you know, squeezing the, squeezing the sponge? Yeah, yeah. You wring the water out? Yep. So slowly, wring the water out, and then relax your hands. Okay. Bring it out and then relax your hand. That's what exactly And when what she's, I'm wow, look at that. That's already improvement. And then when she's giving into that pressure, you release, and right? And I soften. I just be soft and gentle with her, but I'm there. So don't be afraid. But just be there. Kind of like three branches out of a tree trunk. Just be there. Yeah. You know, you're not really doing much, you're just support. So when you have to, yes, you'll squeeze, you'll flex. But it's a lot of feet and legs. So I'm going to change direction. I sit until my inside seat bone steps into the stirrup. Keep my outside legs back. Uh -uh. And then change. So immediately I change. New inside leg at the girth. New outside leg back about four inches. So I can pull it haunted. Now this direction. So of course her left lead can't her side. She was actually really stiff. And it's not so much stiff in the neck. It was just she couldn't stretch out back here. And she's actually using her time as an excuse to say, I'm going to scoop this. Immediately, I flex her a little bit more than usual. Okay. And, and use my inside leg. And I said, no, this is where we are. I don't care about the crow, the fields. Just be here. And she's starting to, like, at first it was more like a fight. Like, no, yeah, I'm allowed to look all over the place. Yep. <laughs> I was like, no, you're not. I am on you. You must be me. You got me for one hour, and then you got yourself for the rest of your day. <laughs> so look around. <laughs> you get fed expensive food. You have expensive poop, kids, so you got to work for me. Now... When I ride, I ride the shoulder. I don't ride the neck. So think about riding the shoulder. I sit back here a little bit. I wide my hands a little bit. She's got a five inch bit, so you can keep her hands at least five inches wide. Love it. Uh, I know hunters are all about that. Look pretty with the hands up here. Hate it. So for size, it's completely different. For size, we sit back, we widen our hands with the young horses. We want them to stretch into the bit. When she starts scooping, immediately stretch your hands wide. Okay. Slide it inside leg, tap, 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 and just keep her. Like, no, you have to stay down here. Okay. The more we can get her to understand to relax and, and go down, the better she will get through her back. Right. And her abdominals will get stronger. Right. Because when she's up here, she's hollowed right here. But when she's down and flexed and round, she's giving with her back and contracting her abdominals. Yeah, you can see it. Yes. It's beautiful. So, you know, and, you know, like I told you, she, there's nothing wrong with her. She just needs, like, some fine tuning. Like, this is where you need to be. And she's just using this opportunity, you know, now, like, okay, going in this direction, there's something over there. And it probably is. probably pushing through the deer. <laughs> so, I will actually make it boring now. And 
and just make her walk circles. So just think about your position, your new inside leg, your new outside leg, which I like to count it back to. Nice. It's going to be different than patterns. The patterns is an A-frame, and for, in dressage, we're more in a U frame. You open up your hip, you relax your knee, and you let your toes go straight. Up. She's just using this time now to say, I want to get out of here. <laughs> I know. I have not She butt scoots. But this is like normal. I mean, it's... Yeah. No problem. But the, the intervals of silliness, she actually was perfect yesterday, but now I just pulled the wind. And she's just going to go straight and just do that. Yeah. Now, it's just a lot of it. Uh-uh. So she's already wanting to look out. I'm like, no. Immediately. Flex her. And then when she goes down, soft. Okay. Oh, she looks gorgeous. Okay, so I, yeah, I have uh -huh. her work on transition and then show it off. Give her more, let her have a nice working trot. This is slower than a working trot. Okay. But she's balanced. Push, 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 push. <gasps> so, I had to kick her with my outside. Right. But. Now, I think it's all about. Yeah, this is fun, right? All right, let's go find a toy. Come on. Come on, Fence. Oh, I see the horse toys. Here we go. That's all the dog food. There's the toys. All right. What do you think? You want to pick out a toy? No? Okay. Exciting, right? All right. Look, there's halters. <laughs> All right, we're buying that. Okay, that's what she picked. You want a new toy? A new ball? Oh, wow. What do you think? You want a ducky? Are you excited? Who's this? Who's this? Is mommy back, Puddy? Oh, Puddy, mommy's back. There's your mommy. Oh, Puddy's so happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so nice. Okay, get out, buddy says, get out of the way, my mommy. There's mommy. 